The final 30 has been set. Congrats to Dustin Johnson, who notched his third win of the season this week at the BMW Championship. With the win, DJ is now first in the FedEx Cup standings as we head to East Lake for the Tour Championship. You know, I rarely keep it under 300. Yep, we know DJ, the longest driver on tour, was a driver of a different kind earlier in the week. The players had fun on the track at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway while in town for the third leg of the FedEx Cup playoffs. Another special day this week, the king himself, Arnold Palmer, turned 87 on Saturday. He has touched so many around the game of golf and several players wished him a big happy birthday including Rory McIlroy, who posted to Facebook this awesome photo of him and Arnie. Goat, recognize Goat. Tiger Woods tweeting, thanks Arnie for 25 years of friendship. Can't talk golf without thinking about the king. Happy 87th. Speaking of Tiger, I'm not sure if you've heard, but he's back. Tiger Woods blew up the internet this week, announcing his hopeful return to golf in October at the Safeway Open and beyond. And as you can imagine, people were pretty pumped. From one legend to another, Jack Nicklaus was one of the first to chime in and share his excitement for the Big Cat's return. Others like Gary Player, Luke Donald, and Shane Lowry chimed in as well. But the day before his big announcement, Woods took part in what I will go on to guess was the most epic career day ever. How do you top that? Tiger taking part in his son Charlie's career day at school. Maybe he told him not to eat too much fast food too? Unless of course your name is Beef. Our favorite Andrew Beef Johnston is back over here in the States playing on the web.com tour finals. Because of his amazing Arby's sponsorship, a caring fan brought him Arby's at the turn and of course, Beef was all about it. Classic. Another classic? Happy Gilmore, of course. The folks at Cinefix recreated the movie in video game format as a part of their 8-bit cinema series. This is just amazing. I mean, check it out. They even included chubs. It's all in the hips. It's all in the hips. That will do it for this week's Trending on Tour. We have the Web.com Tour Finals in full swing and another edition of the Good, Bad and Unusual coming your way. Have a great week.